Hello, this is Tyler with Theater Design Company. I'm going to give you a quick overview of adding an automated Z-Wave light switch to your Alarm.com account. We've got a couple steps that are done here. The first step will be done by your dealer, which I'm dragging over right now. And what that's going to require is for under your Empower device list, you're going to need to see your Z-Wave or your smart devices that you want to add and automate um, under your Alarm.com account. So in this case, we're doing a light dimmer, which we're actually going to change the name and do a few other things um, on our alarm.com account. This is the dealer side, so most likely you won't see this side if you're an end user. Um, the other thing to note about this is you need to have the interactive package with automation or a package that allows you to do light switch um, and automation features. Some basic alarm packages won't have these. So we will exit out of this, and what I'll actually do is drag over a demo account. And so we have a demo account here. You can see it's being used. It's giving us the weather here in Seattle. Panel is disarmed right now, and here's our light dimmer right here, um, ID number four. So we've got a couple different things here on that. So rules, schedules is the easiest way to do it. You can also go click up here and also drop down to automation and change things here. Schedules again. So we can add a new schedule. And on this case, what we're going to do is we're going to add a light dimmer and we want this thing to turn on at sunset and we want to leave it on or turn it off at in this case sunrise so sunset to sunrise and we want it on each day no reason not to keep it on every day so name a rule we'll do outdoor lighting which is what this is so we've added outdoor lighting we'll change the light dimmer name here in a minute but as of right now this light at sunset will turn on at sunrise will turn off exactly what you need we will save that and there's your action here so we don't need to edit anything else and we've got rules we've got a bunch of other stuff we'll go through training on here but the first thing I want to do is get this outdoor lighting on an outdoor schedule and go to settings got devices so in this case we want to change the name of this thing to our Z-Wave light to out door light switch. So now we've changed that name there. We're going to save it and let's get out of there. Go back to our home page. And now we have our light dimmer, and this will change as we set up our schedule. It's set on outdoor light switch. It's updating. This is real time, so this is on a house that's a good hour and a half from my residence right now. Let's exit back out of here. And it's still updating. There we go. It is now outdoor light switch. It's on right now at 100%. And that actually adds that. And no more needs to be done on this. And we will move on to another project and another video showing another alarm.com feature. I move through these pretty quick because I've done a lot of alarm.coms, but this gives you an idea of how to add a Z-Wave outdoor light switch to your alarm.com account. Thank you.